Good morning, guys, and welcome to the replay. Hopefully, Facebook is cooperating today. The API server was down yesterday, so let's see. Good morning. I can see we're back on YouTube. It was an API server issue yesterday with Facebook, so it could not connect. Let me just get into um, YouTube real quick, and we will go from there. How is everybody's morning? Are you ready for some early morning chalking and coffee? Because I got my coffee, and I have a new Ray mug, too, to go with it. Oops. Goes. Hi, Sharon and Laura and Judy Bell. Hi, Donna. Hi, Laura Woods. How are you guys? Hopefully, I'll be able to see all comments now as you guys are coming in. Make sure you're saying hello as you come in. Um. Hi, Gabby. Good morning on YouTube. I am a hot mess. Do not mind me. It was a very late night. We had some issues with the air yesterday, so we did not make it down the shore. Big surprise. Um, yeah, brand new air conditioner. Like, just got central air put in in, like, late October, beginning of November. We had um, our condenser was clogged. And the guy said, you know, thank God. He's like, sometimes when people are moving things around, they forget to slide the pan that goes back under it. And I said, why is that a thank God? He said, because in the pan is a sensor that detects water. And when it picks up on the water, it shuts the air conditioner off. Because if not, he said, you wind up leaking and um, you'll flood your house out. So that was great. So thank God we got that figured out. Um, there he goes. There's more people coming in. Hi, Cal. Hi, Judy. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Donna. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. So, um, speaking of good morning, my Ray Dunn of the day, my new mug, found it yesterday. Good morning. I love it. I don't have this one, so that was a fun find. That was, like, just stashed by the register, like, near all the impulse items. I was like, hey now. Hi, Susan Deeney. Good morning, Brianna. Um, my application got over submitted yesterday. Aside from some papers that is needed, I'm so pleased. Yay, Gabby, I'm so excited for you. Good morning, Felicia. So, as you guys are coming in, if you are on Facebook, bottom left-hand side of your mobile device is the share button. If you are not a Chalk Couture designer, I would love it if you'd hit share. Um, and if you are on YouTube, under the live video, to the left of the live chat is the share button. I would love it if you would share, once again, if you are not a designer. Um, also... If you are on Facebook and you're like, wait, you have a YouTube channel? I do. Here's my YouTube channel. Screenshot it. Um, take a pic of it. I'd love for you to go over and jump onto YouTube because yesterday when I couldn't get on live, this was a perfect example. All the people on YouTube were getting my notifications. Facebook could not connect me. So definitely take a look at it. Now, if you're on YouTube and you're like, what? She's on Facebook. Once again, screenshot that. That is my business page. That is where I broadcast live. That is where I put all of my updates. That is where I post, you know, oh, hey, I'm going live and, and so fast to do this, blah, blah, blah. Um, and heck, I might as well put this up here too. If you're on Instagram, my Instagram handle is the same as my YouTube handle. So follow me there too. Um, now, what we are going to do is... Um, today we're going to play with flying lessons. I, as soon as I saw this, I was like, I have got to have this transfer. This is perfect. And yesterday 
I was straight up in Hobby Lobby buying all pumpkins, okay? Um, and all things floral decor to add with all of my new um, fall, uh, autumn, winter stuff that is coming up in the new catalog. I'm going to be ready for next week when that box gets delivered. I'm telling you, I'm ready. Good morning, Susan. Hi, Dawn Marie. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Tanya. Hi, Danny. Hi, Susan. Hi, Mary. Hi, Linda. Hi, Charlene. Hi. Yay, right? Hi, B.B. Adams. Hi, Cheryl Shepard. I hope you guys have your coffee because it's early morning chalking and coffee. Tell me down below what is in your cup this morning. Mine is Starbucks Columbia. It's not. It doesn't say Colombian. It says Columbia. Um, and my favorite Dunkin' Donuts, extra, extra. Yum. Um, so, hi, Nancy. Hello, hello. Good morning, guys. I'm so glad you're here and you're on. I'm a hot mess. Um, like I said, it's early morning chalking and coffee. You're not allowed to judge during that time. Because I have to get a shower after this. Hi, Cat White. Good morning, Charlene. Good morning, Patty. Hi, Christina. Um, so let's get into this, shall we? Oh, wait, last thing. If you have um, never seen Chalk Couture in action, um, or you've seen it, but you are not currently working with a designer, will you put a one down below? Because I would love to be your designer. Um, you can even say me, and then that way I can message you the link to my VIP group. Um, if you are already an amazing Chalk Couture designer, please put a two down below in the comments. And if you're on Facebook, show me some love. Throw some hearts up. But while I get my screens ready, I'm going to give you a little something all about Chalk Couture so that way you guys can read up on it. There it goes. All righty. I think everybody has had enough time to read all that. So we are going to be using flying lessons along with our gorgeous Aiden um, porcelain steel magnetic chalkboard in a nine by 12 size. This board is awesome. Oh, thanks for all the hearts, guys. I love it. Good morning, Roberta. Caramel coffee, Nancy. That sounds yummy. Hi, Kelsey Maxwell. How are you? Dr. Pepper in your cup, Patty. I love it. Maxwell House. Brittany and Cat White says coffee. Hi, Roberta. Hot tea and a Ray Dunn tea mug. Yay. Cal, I found a black tea mug. Um, uh, Black tea. Like the color black of the mug saying tea. And yesterday I also found the color black um, boss lady, I think it says. I can't remember if it's girl boss or boss lady, but I found that. I was like, yay. Hey, look. Good morning. I found that. So, all righty. Oh, cancel that. Please, please just go back to it. There it goes. Cheryl Shepard. Already had coffee now having a glass of ruby red grapefruit juice. Yum. Hi, Ann Smith. Hello. Hi, Norma Spencer from Georgia. Good morning. Thanks for joining on YouTube. Okay, so I think I read everybody's cups of tea. Black silk with hazelnut. That sounds good, Donna. Good morning, Margie. Mackenzie Potts. I am going to message you the link to my VIP group. I welcome you. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. That is awesome. Hi, Vicki. Hi, Lisa. Pammy has Starbucks white chocolate mocha. Margie has Sam's Club members, makers, or Sam's Club makers, Mark Colombian. Oh, I love Colombian. Mackenzie, you got it, girl. I just messaged you. Uh, I just met, uh, commented. Um, in the reply, the link to my VIP group. I'd love for you to join it. Laura has Almond Joy Creamer Maxwell House. That sounds yummy. Hi, Dee Dee. Hello, hello. Um, I hope you can see the link to my VIP group, girl. Hi, Vicky. Caramel Frappuccino. Yum. Yum, yum, yum. Love it. All righty. So let's go ahead and let's do this then, huh? So today I'm going to be using um, Bright White. Fig, because y'all know I love fig, and some shimmer silver to make this board. So I am super pumped about it, okay? That would be nice to mix with reindeers for Christmas. The flying lesson? Yeah, I mean, what would be nice? Oh, you got me so confused. You got me confused, girl. Um, Where is my marker? Hello, marker. There it is. Okay. So as you guys read, hi, Sandra. Good morning, Debbie Green. As you guys read, good morning, Vicki. Um, 
our transfers are reusable over and over and over again, okay? So the very first thing we're going to do when we take it out of the package is we are going to label the back. Oh, and can you guys do me a huge favor while you are watching? If you are live, can you please say hashtag live so I know who is live viewing and who is replaying? If you're catching the replay, please do hashtag replay. Um, so the very first thing we're going to do is flying. Uh, we're going to label the back of it with what the title of the transfer is. Or you could just say back, okay? I'm just going to say flying lessons, okay? The reason we do this is because this transfer is built with a, um, a paper backing, and then the side that the transfer's on is actually a glossy side. Can you guys see that glossy shine? That's for the transfer to really stick to. We want to notate the correct side because sometimes not everybody will see that, okay? After that, we're going to go ahead and get our fuzzing towel, and we are going to fuzz up our transfer. Now, what does that mean to fuzz it up? To fuzz it up means to help get some of that excess stick off. So that way it doesn't like stick like crazy to our, um, to our board. Okay. Or whatever surface we're going to use it on. Now, as you know, chalk paste can be used on chalkboards, wood, metal, tin, glass, canvas, burlap, dry erase boards, mirrors, plastic, and more. And the coolest part is that it comes off with water off most of those surfaces, 70% of those surfaces to be precise. Burlap, canvas, and wood, it's going to be a mess. It's not going to come off. Everything else, it comes right off with water. Now, we fuzzed up our transfer, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to place it down onto whichever surface we are wanting to work with. Now, like I said, I'm on our Aiden porcelain steel board. Now, really quickly, fuzzing towel. And save you guys the hassle, because it took me a month and a half to figure this out. If you're using our fuzzing towel, the side that has the... Tag is the fuzzing side. The opposite side is the board cleaning side. It's the microfiber side. It'll leave no fibers on your board, okay? So, let's see. Hi, Karen. Hi, Dallas. Hi, Tammy. Hi. Still in bed. Thanks, guys. Hi, Sheila Whitford. How are you? Hi, Dawn Marie and Dee Dee. Hi, Dawn Gardy. How are you? Um, thank you guys so much. Mackenzie Potts is live, my new friend. Tammy, yeah. Uh, all righty, good. Thanks, guys. Chucking with Vicky. Hello, good morning. Oopsie daisy. Making a landfall. Do you like flavor creamers? International delays of delicious southern butter pecan. Mmm. That stuff is addictive. Sure, I'll have to try it. Oh, I got you. The flying lessons part. Oh, that would be so cute. Yes. Love that, Gabby. And we do have the new transfer that has Santa and the reindeer flying in the sky. That would be so cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. Great idea. Good morning, Karen. Hi, Pam. How are you? Okay. So, hey, Shirley S. Now that we have this down, we are going to take some of our... Whoops. Get that back in there. We're going to take some stirring sticks and we're going to get some squeegees. And I'm going to take um, the mini squeegee. And I am also even going to use um, multi-tools here because some of these colors, I don't, obviously I don't want to mix my colors, um, but there's going to be spots where I can, I need to do like the little dots one color and then I want to do this another color here. Let me see if I can zoom it in too for you guys. There it goes. So if I move it over. There it goes. So I'm going to, that way you can see this. So I'm going to start off and I think what I'm going to do is chalk and pull. Okay. You guys know what chalk and uh, pull is. If you don't, you're going to see it right now. So number one, um, whoops, I have way too much volume in the background. I can't figure out where all the volume is coming from. It's like I have nine volumes happening at once. I don't know what it is. Okay, it's a lot of volume in the background here for me. Hi, Ashley. Hi, Lori. Hi, Dawn Marie. I must be weird. I love the plain black coffee with little milk. That, not weird at all. Not weird at all. I'm having a regular coffee with cream and sugar. There you go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, no, now I don't hear any volume. There it goes. No, it's just because I was talking too much. This transfer is the first one for my order from the new catalog. You love it. Yay, Vicky. All right. So 
what we need to do before we do you do anything with the chalk paste is we need to stir it up to a nice yogurt like consistency sometimes there is it gets a little like not chunky but like not as i hate saying this not as loose okay so like my bright white i want it to be like think of fluff and utter okay see how that looks perfect okay little little bit of water at a time if you need to add it in okay um my fig i think is going to be perfect because it just always is because it's like one of the best colors ever can i get this off the board there it goes all right so oh yeah oh yeah it's perfect look at that awesome all right so we've got our colors ready we've got our mini squeegee and our multi-tools ready so here's what I'm going to do. I am going to do the bright white dots with the multi-tool. Okay. And I'm going to pull. I'm just going to go a little bit at a time. Because I don't want to mess it all up. Because I don't want to have any of the bright white where I want to have the fig. And they're kind of close together, so I don't want to do that. Now the fig. I think I'm going to try the, probably not the smartest idea for me to do that, but we're going to see. And I'm going to show you what I mean by chalk and pull, okay? I'm going to chalk a little bit, and then I'm going to pull and pull it down. Oh, see, I already dipped into some of the white, so hopefully it doesn't carry forward. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my fingernail under the transfer somehow. Really? There it goes. My goodness, that was, that was rough for me, you guys. So I'm going to pick it up a little bit, and then I'll put it back down. Okay, so you see how we have this started? We obviously want to peel it back just a little bit because we want to make sure the chalk paste doesn't dry in the screen. Now I realize it might be a little difficult to see at this moment, okay? But all I did was just a little bit of the dots and the fake, okay? So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to press it back down where I need to still chalk, okay? I have no bubbles and now I'm gonna come along the side okay and I think I can get away with using this little squeegee here and I'll just do a little bit at a time and that way I don't mess it up why am I going with my left hand what is that about try and make it be even Okay. Okay, a little bit at a time. Where's my little white here? Go down a little more with the white. Because once I have this part on the side done and on the bottom, I think the inside is going to be pretty easy. Pretty, pretty easy. Okay. There we go. Lift it up again right from the center. Take your time peeling it back. Don't stretch your transfer. Okay, perfect. So let me try this up. Now do not let the heat touch your transfer, okay? 
Don't let that happen. I'm, I'm not going to do the whole inside. I'm just going to push down to finish doing the big and the bright white. Okay. So let's just go down enough. And then once we're done with the fig, we can close it up because this was, that was all that I was going to use the fig for was just the little frame here. And you guys might be asking for who's new watching, why do I keep doing that? Why am I saying chalk and pull? Why am I pulling it back after each time I put some down and put it back down? Well, the reason is simple. The reason we do that is because if you don't, your chalk piece is going to dry in your screen. And then when you go to pull the transfer back, guess what? So does your chalk paste. So you don't want that to happen. <gasps> oh, oh, that was good. So, you do what I call chalk and pull. And you guys, oh darn it, I just put the some of the fig in. Hopefully, I did not really, I don't want to do too much, obviously. Too much of the bright white, because we don't need it. Such a little spot. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift this up, peel it back. Okay. Just enough to peel, peel back all that stuff. Okay. And don't let the heat touch your transfer. It will melt it. I promise you. <laughs> all right. So... I'm going to go to flattening this part out. Okay. Make sure I have no bumps in my silk screen area. And look at that. This wound up going back on perfectly. Okay. So, oh, there was a bump there. Hopefully I got that out. All right. So now let's use our bright white. Actually, you know what? Why don't we do our silver, our shimmer silver on the stars, the moon, and then that way my silver is all done. Okay. And this multi-tool so comes in handy for these little spots. Really does. Look, one, two, three, one, two, three. It's great. It's like a the paintbrush for chalk paste, the multi-tool. Okay, and we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna peel it back. Okay. Making sure I have it all covered is all. Okay. Got all the shimmer silver on. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to peel back again. Get all that shimmer going. Oh, look how good it's looking. Oh, wee. Oh, I'm loving it. Let's make sure it's all dry. And I will check what you guys are saying in just a second. Newbie here, what does it do if the transfer? What do you do if the transfer moves? So, Suze, here's the cool thing. It is adhesive backed. So, if it won't move, but if it say it's a transfer you've been using over and over and over and over and over again because the company does back 8 to 12 times. Um if it moves, it's it's okay because it's chalk paste and we'll come off with water. You can correct your mistake or um you can keep on going. Sometimes 
it actually, believe it or not, will work out in your favor. Sometimes it just looks super cool. It might give you a, um, like a shadow effect. But um, if it moves, no big deal. It comes right off with water. That was an awesome question. I love that, Suze. All right. Uh, let's see. Did I say good morning to Ashley and Laura and Dawn Marie? I think I did. Hi, Ann Schneider. Good morning, Michelle Fox. Hi, Valerie. Hi, Tony Sherman. Hi, Kel. Uh, it's the Aiden board, Michelle. Yes. What is that new Sylvie board? It is not yet. It's this, the Aiden board. Hi, Laura. Hi, Les. Good morning. Hi, Jenny Johnson. Hi, Laura. Hi, Patty Fabrizio. Hi, Renee. Hello, hello. Let's see. Live. Time to fit your first one. Dang it. Got to run. I'll catch the replay. All righty. Sounds good, Cheryl. All right. So now guess what, you guys? We did everything. Um, now we're ready to do the bulk of it, the bright white. Now I'm going to tell you what seems to be the hardest part for me is to just make sure I have no bubbles in my silk screen area here. Um, and other than that, it's turning out pretty well. I, I do say so myself. Okay. So I am going to do the flying lesson first. Whoa, that was a lot. I definitely do not need that much. Just trying to be careful to not mix my colors. You know, make sure you don't pull in your silver or your fig. That is looking perfect. Get all your excess removed from the area. I'm going to just peel back. I don't know why I'm still using this little itty bitty squeegee. Did I lose all volume or is it that I'm just concentrating? Oh boy. There it goes. Okay. I didn't. Trying to go quickly but efficiently remember we don't want the chalk piece to dry in our silk screen area so I'm gonna once again peel back okay okay let's peel so it doesn't get stuck in the silk screen Okay, and then all we're going to have left to do is where it says witch broom. I mean, where it's the witch on the broom. Look how good this is looking. You know, it's weird. The light is finally nice and bright right now, but it's like reflecting hardcore off the board. So it doesn't really look true to color. So just give me a sec. Let me get this last part on and I'll show you how great this is going to look. Oh my gosh, I love it. I almost want to say we should maybe try bumblebee in the center but should we do bumblebee or should we stick it stick it out with white all right here's what i'm gonna ask you guys do you want to see bumblebee in the center um to make it look like the moon um or do you want me to keep with white hi debbie schusler hearing just fine awesome thank you tammy no i'm good woohoo how do you watch the transfer when you're done dallas i will show you that this one is so stinking cute, isn't it, Tanya? Hi, Molly. It's, uh, Molly, this is a 9 by 12 Aiden. Just tune in and miss the water comment. Uh, oh, uh, Dawn, it, 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 the chalk paste will come off with water. All right, let's see. Hopefully you guys are going to start hearing now. Everyone's saying yellow bumblebee. Okay, good. That's what we're going to do. We're going to do bumblebee. Let me close up my chalk paste here so it doesn't, you know, get clunky. Okay, hold on. 
Yeah, I think I have to agree. The the bumblebee, I think, will make it look so cool. Really well. I have little chalkboarders that just fell all over my leg. Okay, let's do some bumblebee. Oh, it's going to look awesome. Look at that. Okay. Let's start up our bumblebee. Oh, I need some more bumblebee. I don't have very much left. I could use a little bit of water. All right, let's get some. Let's get another little mini squeegee out. I'm just going to scoop some bumblebee off with my stir stick. Okay. Oh, this is going to be so good. That was a lot of bumblebee, Jess. I have a lot. Hold on. I scooped way too much off. There we go. And you guys... You know, I am a hot mess for those of you that watch me. If I can do this, anybody can do this. Okay? Anybody can. All right, now, let's get all those lines from all that excess chalk paste off. And pull it down. Get it onto the squeegee and put it back into your jar. Okay? Let's pull. Oh, Bumblebee, you were the way to go. Check that out. Wow. Oh, Bumblebee, you are my friend. Gosh, that looks gorgeous. All right, let me zoom out. So hopefully you, oh, you know what? Here, let's come on back to me. And then I'll move it back to show you guys how I clean the transfers. Look how gorgeous this looks. Wow. Can you guys see that? Oh, yes. Flying lessons. You guys, if you don't have this board, you need it. If you don't have this transfer, you need it. Wow. Oh, this is going to look so good in my entryway. Oh, I'm dying. I cannot wait. I am not trying to rush summer, you guys. You know I am summer girl of the summer. I love being at the beach. But darn it. I cannot wait to decorate for fall. I cannot wait. I can't wait. Oh my gosh. Yes, everybody loves Bumblebee. Yes, 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 yes. Hi, Dina. Oh, it looks so good, doesn't it? Bumblebee, yes, BB. You guys love it? I love it. Okay, now let me come on back down. And I am going to show you guys how we clean our transfers. So that way you know how to get the... Ready for next time. Give me one sec. Let me get my pan ready. Be super careful. There is a lot of electrical stuff over here. This is why I don't usually have it by, but I want you guys to see. Oh. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll put our transfer right in the water. We'll get all of our squeegees and stirry sticks and multi-tools right into the water. Just like this. Okay. Now let's get our chalk piece put away. So that way we have some room. Okay. Hi, Char. Super cute. Thanks, Angela. Oh, Susan, I love it. You can come over for chalk lessons anytime. I keep hearing it sounds like someone knocking. Oh, Tammy, you know what it is? They're putting in my shelves in my dining room because we're getting ready for our, our kitchen run. I was starting next week. Um, 
So they're building me the shelf so I can put all my Ray Dunn on the, on the wall because I won't have a tiny cabinet anymore or a big hutch because we're losing that wall. So yes, it's that, it's my house. <laughs> um, is it, it's just for moving around. I can't wait for fall, but it doesn't last long enough for me. I'd love to keep fall decor year round. Yes. Hi, Rose Borelli. Okay. So thank you, Norma. Now what I will do is this is don't mind my poor board eraser. I have been using it for forever. Um, I always use my board eraser to help get some of the, the chalk paste off of the transfer. It just works out so much easier for me. Um, it's less that I have to clean up with the, with a wet, a wet wipe. It's so much better. Now you guys are seeing this, right? Yep. Okay, good. Cause sometimes I forget to go back down on my hands and then you guys are like, well, that's great. You talked us through it, but you didn't show us because I'm a mess. Okay. So I'm just going to get all the paste off. Now, so you want to do this as soon as, really? Is it 10.15? Stop. Sorry, guys. Hopefully, it, it doesn't make me lose the volume. Did I really go that long chalking? I thought I had snoozed all my alarms. Sorry, guys. Okay, so. We are getting it all off. And I'm just going, normally I'd be like, if I, in the sink, in my wash sink that we I had the guys put in for me, I'd be going to town super lightning quick. There is a lot of electrical stuff, plugs and all, right by where I'm sitting. I am not trying to get electrocuted on a Saturday morning, guys. Not trying to happen. So, I'm just taking my time. Now that I have it done, okay, look, you can do the same thing with your stirring sticks, Okay, have everything all finished, just like so. Yeah, they are directly above me working, so that's what the banging is. Sorry. I told them, I was like, I'm going live, so just come in when you get here. Okay, almost got it all cleaned. Yeah, like, literally... Everything just comes right off with the board eraser. Well, this, except for this, because this sat last night because I used it and forgot to clean it. So that might take a little bit longer to come off, like a couple more seconds sitting. But everything else, see how it just comes off? That's the cool part about this stuff, guys. You can redesign and repeat all you want. All you want. Let's see. I think that's it. Was that all the squeegees? Nope, there's another squeegee. I was going to say, I know I had at least one more. Okay, now that I have all this done. Look, that comes right off. There it goes. Okay, so everything is now clean in here. Now, I'm going to... Oh. Take my transfer and put it onto a drying mat. Now, do not mind my drying mat. It is super stained from chalk paste and stuff, cleaning. Um, it's usually, it's one of the ones I use for my events. I'm going to just put it to the side for one sec. I will show you how I clean it, but I've got to get the water out of the way. I'm scared to death and I'm going to get electrocuted. I don't want to play that game today. Okay, let's put that right there. And I'll pull all these out as well. And I'll show you how I dry them all. This is one of the reasons why I love to have the mat, you guys. I am so excited that we have a mat coming out. I can't wait to use it because it's going to be bigger than the one I have now. There's going to be so much more room. It's going to be great. All right, let me just move the water back now so it doesn't make me get killed. So, what you're going to do is you're going to grab your disinfectant wipes, okay? You're going to transfer. You want to use disinfectant wipes, okay? Hey, Kyle, good morning. Hey, Jan, hey, Vicki. I hear it, you hear it now. I can see that on a shirt without the borders. Absolutely, Molly, for sure. 
My favorite about chalk paste is that you can touch it when it dries and doesn't smear. Exactly. And we'll show you, I'll show that again as well once I get this all cleaned off. Now, using the board eraser seriously helps so much because it really gets all that excess paste off. So you definitely want to look into one. Right now, I do know they are out of stock on my website for, I think uh, it's until mid-July. So it's probably going to be next week. They'll be back in by Friday. Um, so if you don't have them, stock up on them. They're $2.99 for a two-pack or $3.99. No, $2.99 for a two-pack. They are awesome. Now, you should know, sometimes with certain colors, I'm zooming it in so you can see, there will be some light staining. It means nothing. It means your transfer is well-loved. It does not affect it. It doesn't do any of that, okay? Now, after you had the, the front all cleaned up, um, you get it all nice and clean to your liking, all that excess paste off, flip it over, and you're going to do the same thing to the back, and you're going to let it dry. Look, it's already starting to get sticky again. Can you see that? Um, you're going to let it dry. Once it dries, it's going to be all sticky again. Now, I usually just go in suit and keep on going and get my squeegees and all cleaned. I'm not, I don't need to be this close in. Whoa, zoom out, zoom out. Okay, I just literally will go through, clean all my squeegees off from what I missed from the water. There we go. Good morning, Susan Tapley. And I'll show you guys how it ended up. Give me one more second. I'm almost done. Like, I clean everything. Our stirring sticks. Why keep on buying? For, well, I keep buying because they do eventually... You know, you can see that they're like, the color's not going to come off. Like, I've probably used my stir sticks three, four hundred times. I use them every time I chalk, and I use multiple colors all the time. Okay? So, all cleaned. Throw that away. I just have to wait, woo, for this to dry. Where would be a towel to dry my hands? Come on. Okay, let me clean. Get soak that water up here. All right, I will put this to the side. So that way it dries and let me pull this back out for you guys to show you how good this turned out. Look at that. I love it. All right, let's come on back to me. Okay. So we use bright white fig shimmer silver and bumblebee to create this. This is the flying lessons transfer. It's super awesome. Hi Jen. Hi Vicki. Hello. Hello. Do the squeegees ever wear out? Denise, I've been using the same squeegee since the day I started. And this Aiden chalkboard is the exact same Aiden chalkboard I got in my new designer kit. Um, they are quality. They are quality. The only squeegees I am still not using from when I started are the ones that got taken <laughs> during making takes or something. So, <clears throat> as you can see, it's all dry really quickly. I do want to show this. Once it's all dry, you can rub your hands all over. It's not going anywhere. But remember, I can spray this whole thing clear with water. You know, if you want it to stay on forever, Krylon Sealing Spray. So let's chit chat. If while you were watching this, you said, you know, I am in love with what she just did, but I'm not working with a designer. Who do I shop from? Me. You can shop from me. I would love to be your designer. Comment me down below and I'll message you the link to my VIP group. In my VIP group, I have tons of stuff going on. This is a... We're coming to the end of Christmas in July week. Tomorrow is our last day. I have lots of specials going in there. Bundle offers, um, try me kits, intro kits. Um, I do my own monthly uh, chalk subscription to you. Um, there's a lot going on in there and over 600 videos. So hopefully you'll find some inspiration with it. If you want to get in there, comment me down below and I'll message you the link. Now, as you were watching, um, if you said, you know what? It is time. I am ready. I'm going to, I want to buy that business in a box. Um, I'm ready to start my empire. Well, I love hearing that and I'm here to help you. If you want to get your hands on this gorgeous box, it is um, $99 US, $129 Canadian. That's right. If you're Canadian in Alberta, British Columbia, Manitoba, Ontario, or Saskatchewan, you can join my team. Um, the $99 US or $129 Canadian comes with the new catalog, the startup guide, 12 thank you cards, an apron, a small squeegee, seven transfers, five chalk paste. You'll get bright white eucalyptus, guava, curry, and tide. The gorgeous eight inch chalkboard that I'm chalking on. You're going to get a five by seven um, board and base. And you're also going to get the 12 pack of the chalkable chips. 
um, which are awesome sauce. Um, so if you are interested in going into my opportunity group, um, comment join down below to hear the information. I want you to make, um, I want you to hear everything during my opportunity call. It's only about 25 minutes long, but it goes over everything. So you can make an educated decision about if you are ready to join Chalk Couture and more importantly, are you ready to join my team? So that is that. Now, last but certainly not least, let's talk about the best club that is out there. The best club that comes right to your door without fail every month, and that's Club Couture. Um, club Couture is an amazing subscription uh, plan that we offer. It comes with an exclusive size B transfer that you can only get your hands on by joining Club Couture and three chalk paste singles. Um, if you are in the U.S., it is $19.99 plus tax, free shipping. If you're in Canada, it's $26.99 plus tax, free shipping. Um, it's a three-month minimum commitment. If you join in July, you will not be billed until August the 5th, um, then September 5th, then October the 5th. Um, and once you add Club Couture to your cart, you'll be able to get July's Club Couture, which is Here Comes the Sun. And it's so flipping cute, you guys. Um, you will love it. Now, we also do have a Kickstarter kit currently that is actually sold out online. But if you do join, I will make sure um, that we will be able to get you a Kickstarter kit, even if it means I have to, you know, we'll figure it out. But that's what I'll tell you. Um, there is a 8 in 9 by 12 porcelain steel magnetic chalkboard. There's a board and base, a two pack of those awesome squeegee um, board erasers I was talking about, a small squeegee, our super awesome multi tool, and the three ounce bright white chalk paste. Okay. Um, you are not going to want to miss out. Additionally, um, all Club Couture's um, Club Couture uh, design. Uh, customers are going to get the ability to have a bounce back. You see that bounce back coupon. Um, what that means is if you, uh, hold on, let me pull that up. Hold on. Sorry. What? Everything is in the way. Here it goes. Um, if you spend, um, there's a minimum dollar amount. You'll have all this information in your email. If you spend a minimum dollar amount this month, um, in one order in my club online store, you are going to get a bounce back coupon to be used next month off a minimum order. How cool is that? Super awesome. So if you um, are excited about becoming a Club Couture member, um, please comment Club Couture down below or just go right to my website and sign up. You will love it. So that's all she wrote today, guys. I am done. I really, really hope you love my awesome flying lessons transfer. Hi, Patty. Thank you. I love the Bumblebee too. The Bumblebee made it, I think. It's perfect. It screams Halloween to me. Um, let me make sure I didn't miss any comments over here. <coughs> Brad and Connie, you got it. Susan Dini, you are in my VIP group. I know that for a fact. Um, I am, I just uh, commented Brad and Connie, Conley, Condre, you're uh, the link to my VIP group. I just commented it right underneath um, your comment. So you are, you have the link. Just go on in. I love Club Couture too, Suze. Susan Dini, yes, you are in, but I'm going to message you the link too, just so you know where to go to, to get to it. But you are in my Club Couture group, girlfriend. Um, the board is 9 by 12, uh, Tanya. It is uh, 9 by 12, and it is the Aiden board that comes in our new designer kits, but people can get it just by going to my website. That's it. That is it. All right, you guys. I hope you have a great day. I'll be back tomorrow morning with another early morning chalking and coffee. I'm going to go um, make myself another cup um, and get some things done here. I might even make some more projects. I'll make sure if I do create anything else, I always record. It'll just be safe for a sped up video when I am not home to go live. All right, guys. Take good care. Enjoy your Saturday. And I will talk to you all later. Bye.